A federal judge just voided the CDC's extension of the federal mask mandate on airplanes and other transportation, calling it unlawful. Shelly Bortz joins us live with details. Shelly. The latest decision on masking in, uh, affects every aspect of public transportation, including airplanes, buses, taxis, rideshare vehicles, trains, and even transportation hubs. Now, federal judge Catherine Kimball Mizell says the CDC improperly failed to justify its decision and did not follow proper rulemaking. In her ruling, she says the only remedy was to vacate the mandate entirely because it would be impossible to end it for the limited group of people who objected to it. Now, meanwhile, as some mask mandates end, others are returning. Today, Philadelphia reinstated its indoor mask mandate. The city reimposed indoor masking because of increasing cases of COVID-19. Philly's health commissioner says the recent rise in cases met the city's threshold for their second response level, which includes an indoor mask requirement in all indoor public places, including schools, businesses, and restaurants. But a group of business owners and residents have filed suit seeking to overturn the renewed mandate. We have people here who have saved all their lives to run restaurants, open gyms, chiropractic services and other businesses in Philadelphia. Um, what they're telling me is that when these mask mandates are in place and people have to wear masks indoors, they, that they lose substantial amounts of their business. Now, leaders in Philly say COVID cases have increased by 50% over the last two weeks. Now, meantime, the CDC's extension was supposed to end on May 3rd. The agency hasn't said yet if it plans to appeal the judge's ruling. Reporting live downtown tonight, Shelley Bortz, KDKA News.